This is an oil pump from my SVT Focus. It was, I think, run out of oil at one point. But anyway, it's a Geroder style pump is what it's called, oil pump. This is pretty modern. This is how like most new Fords and, and new vehicles in general have, have their oil pumps. But anyway, if you take this back plate off with these, these screws right here, you can pull this off. And these are the oil pump gears. These are the actual gears that do the pumping. And so you can see that if we center up this gear onto the actual crankshaft, something like that, you can see it's centered that it leaves a gap right here and as it's rolling around these these gears are being turned the, actually the inner gear is being turned with these little teeth right here as the crank spins and it's pulling this around and as it comes across this way you can see the the little pockets are getting bigger and what that does is that sucks the oil through this the pickup tube it comes through here and gets into this cavity all this side right over here and basically as these holes go from small to larger it creates a vacuum and sucks it into this pump then it passes through this chamber right here pot it's like a positive pump positive displacement pump and it pushes it through and then these cavities start getting smaller and it pushes it pushes it out through the bottom into this side and then it goes through this hole and then out through here and then this is where it enters into the engine block for your main bearings and your you know cam bearings and everything so one other thing you'll notice with this pump is it has this bypass right here and basically that's a spring loaded um, valve that basically as pressure increases on this side of the um, bypass it gets to a, a certain pressure that overpowers this spring and this pushes down and then it opens and uh, the oil can actually bypass this pump so you don't like totally screw something up or hydraulic this pump so anyway so basically if you're going at like huge rpms or like very abusive rev limiter you can um, abuse these oil pump gears and they can break um, like a typical one I, I assume is probably like cast I'm guessing and then they machine it all down to this you know perfect shape um, or maybe like a powdered metal type thing whereas like the better ones are probably like one solid extruded piece of billet and or maybe even a forged piece that's machined so they're just higher quality materials and so that prevents these from breaking because obviously if this ring breaks then it doesn't pump and the pump goes bad so anyway hopefully you learned a little something about these geroder style pumps but this is a pretty modern style of oil pump the housing kind of changes but they all kind of work the same <laughs> <laughs>